It's a chance to marvel while helping science research. MTN's Geneva Zoltek takes us to Mount Jumbo and shares more about the elk spotters program. I'm here at Waterworks Hill in Missoula and right behind me is Mount Jumbo. Now much of Mount Jumbo is closed during the winter because elk use it as a part of their winter range. The animals can be spotted here from the valley floor. The elk spotters pro program has been going on um, for just shy of 20 years. So. Missoula Parks and Rec Conservation Lands Program Manager Jeff Gicklehorn chose a small hike to showcase the vantage point of the area. You know, the city purchased Mount Jumbo in 1995, and in 1997, the city adopted a management plan for Mount Jumbo. That plan prioritized the traditional elk habitat of the mountain. When winter snow depletes forage at higher elevations, a herd moves to this lower elevation to feed. Seen here in September during the rut. On the mountain, um, you can see these large open areas. That's really, you know, uh, we have defined zones. So I want to say it's A through H, uh, and they kind of ring the mountain. Over the winter months, an elk herd of about 75 to 100 roam these zones right next to the heart of Missoula. Just five permanent staff manage over 5,000 acres of conservation lands around the city. So with the help of a citizen science program, closer tabs are kept on these elk. Yeah, I usually go out in the late afternoon, early evening. Up in the Rattlesnake neighborhood, Sarah Captaville has a prime view of the mountain from her house. My back porch is a perfect view from here and then just get out my binoculars and, and count them. Um, try and make more observations, but sometimes it's hard to tell you know, if they're bulls or calves or cows. Um, and yeah, just do that daily and, and report the observations online. She gave me a tutorial on spotting. They don't come down too far. Scanning the mountain with binoculars, though the naked eye or a spotting scope can also do the trick. I love citizen science. I think it's just an amazing thing to do and anyone can do it. I think that that's, it's really important because we're you know, eyes on the ground um, and taking these observations is really crucial to understanding kind of the elk and how they move on the landscape and how they interact with their different habitats. Sarah is correct. Literally anyone can wow, do this citizen science. You know. After any elk observation this winter, you can go online, fill out the reporting form, and drop a pin where the sighting landed geographically. The collected data is used by the city and Montana Fish, Wildlife, and Parks to determine the appropriate course of action for reopening Mount Jumbo once all elk have exited. But I think there's something really special about the elk herd and having their winter home be right outside my house. Elk spotting continues until May 1st. In Missoula, Geneva Zoltek, MTN News.